This is 25 pounds. Y'all think it's not a lot? Try walking around with this all day long. On your back, on your side. Ooh wee, above your head. 25 pounds, this is how much I've lost in a little over 30 days, maybe 35 days. All right, this is me, Erica back again and i want you to get a good look at the number right here 35. that's how much i've lost so far i can't this 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 is too much this is so heavy i can't believe it okay everyone here i am again 40 pounds 40 pounds lighter. Now I'm gonna be honest with you. I can barely hold this and talk at the same time. Um, wow. To get to this 40 pounds, it took a lot of patience, a lot of perseverance. Um, I had to open up and let go of some things that I would normally hold in to get to this point. So um, I definitely had to tear down some bricks from my wall, if you will. And uh, oh my gosh, this is heavy. Look how big this is. Hello everyone, I know it's been a while. I wanna let you know I'm still in the game. I'm still going hard. What you're looking at right here is 45 pounds. That is what I have gotten rid of so far. 45 pounds of heavy weight, 45 pounds of fat, 45 pounds of stress, 45 pounds of heartache, 45 pounds of sickness. Let me tell you, People ask me all the time, Erica, what are you doing? What does it take? Let me tell you. First of all, God is my strength. He is my source of strength. And he is the reason why I have gotten this far. But he sent me resources. He sent me fitness on fire. He sent me nutritionist guru. He sent me fire. And they have guided me each and every step of the way. They guide me in my nutrition. Guide me in my fitness so I am so thankful for the resources that God has given me with fitness on fire but I have to tell you if you want to do this you have to make up in your mind before you even begin that you're not gonna let the obstacles stop you because let me tell you they are coming you will encounter obstacles but you have to be determined you have to be consistent you have to be focused you have to trample on those obstacles as they come your way and keep on moving you hadn't seen me in a while because I was rear-ended by someone who was going the, by, 45 55 miles an hour and they didn't stop in time and they rear-ended me and I hurt my back Two weeks after that I fell down the stairs and hurt my back again, but I got back up And those aren't the only obstacles that I face I don't have time to tell you about everything that has happened from June to now But what I can tell you is I'm still here don't blink too long because when you open your eyes again i'm gonna be back at 50 and then i'm gonna be at 55 and i'm gonna keep on going oh.